Hi, sixth graders. It's Mrs. Johnson. Today is December 7th. It is Monday. So last week we started talking about um, how society can affect different technologies and how um, because of changes in society, we also create new technologies and then those technologies can lead to more changes in society. And so you guys on Thursday did your 3.6 notes and on Friday did your 3.6 digital lesson. And so the first thing we're going to do is you, we're going to go through and just kind of correct those and chat about um, some of the concepts that we learned. So if you are not in class today, please make sure you go through and correct both your notes and your digital lesson. Your digital lesson should already be submitted to me, but if it isn't, make sure you submit it prior to correcting it. Once we're finished with that, we are going to start a project that we'll be working on for the rest of the week. It's called the Technology Changes Over Time. And so I'm going to click on this, and this link is going to bring us to the project that we're going to be doing all week long. Um, so today what we're going to be doing is choosing our topic, making a copy of the notes and research sheet, and then if we have some extra time, start your research. Okay, so here is the project page. All right, so it says you will be researching a technology that has changed over time. You will be looking at not only how, but also why it has changed. So what impact society has had on that technology. You will be creating either a timeline or a comparison poster showing these changes. So there's a direction sheet right here I'll read through with you. So background, changes to technology over time has affected many aspects of life. The way we lived in the past is different from the way we live today, and this is vastly due to changes in technology. Technological changes affect the way we work, travel, communicate, and play. You will explore how your technology has impacted other changing technologies. Current digital systems such as computers, smartphones, tablets, and laptops have evolved over time. The availability of the internet provides us with ready access to information anytime, anywhere. Connectivity enables us to conduct our shopping and banking online. We can stay in touch and communicate instantly with friends and family anywhere in the world. You will consider the impact of these technological changes as you compare a current digital solution with the way that might this might have been solved in the past. So your task is you will be researching how and why a technology has changed over time. You will be creating a timeline or poster showing this information for your chosen technology. This will be worth 15 points and will be a summative grade, so like a test. There will be no retakes, so make sure that you're asking questions as you're doing the project. Here are the steps, and I'm going to be breaking this down throughout the week. So step one that we're going to do today is choose a technology that has changed over time. Some examples might be Cars, phones, music players, heaters, refrigeration, uh, computers, lights, transportation. You might have another idea. You can run that by me and let me know. Step two, do research on your technology. Use this note sheet to collect information. Once you are finished with your research, you'll need to meet with your teacher one-on-one -on -one to check your progress. Message me on GoGuardian when you are ready. I'm also going to have you share your um, note sheet with me and I can check it that way. Step three, choose one of the following projects to create. You will compare and contrast an early type of your technology with the most current type of your technology. And your project will be to create an advertisement or poster showing side-by-side -side comparisons. Or you'll show the evolution of your technology over time. Create a timeline showing these changes. Step four, you'll upload your project to the media album by the due date. So how it's gonna be graded? five points for explaining how the function of your technology has changed over time. So how is your technology used differently today than it has in the past? And explains why the technology has changed over time. So what impact has society had on your technology? So what was the reason for changing it or making it uh, better or different? And then also that you include pictures and correct information. And there will be a more detailed rubric on the assignment. Okay, so for today, on Monday, you are going to choose what you would like to research. You are going to make a copy of the research notes. And then if you have time, you can start researching and filling in your notes. And so that would be this sheet. 
that's going to make you make a copy of this. Go ahead and save it in your Google Drive. Oops, I think I'm making a bunch of copies of it. I better be patient. Okay. And so it looks like this. So you're going to write in the topic I chose to research is. Then you're going to find your most early piece of technology and write about it in here and find a picture and put it there. And then um, depending on what project you're doing, um, you if you're doing the comparison and contrasting, you're going to need to have more information for each of those two. Um, but then what you're not going to have is you're not going to have all of these. Okay, You'll just have one more picture and model. And you'll talk about um, the most current model, what year it was made in, um, maybe who made it or invented it or made it better or worked on it, other information, why it was changed and how it's used differently today than your original one was. If you're doing a timeline, you'll have um, multiple pictures. Maybe you'll have three, four. Some of them, um, there's a lot of information out there, so a lot of cool models, the way things have changed over time. So maybe you'll have, I think I have like six spaces in here. It's kind of a, up to you how many you put in there, okay? Um, there's a couple of websites that have some good links. Um, this Thoughtco, if you click on this link, there's a little search um, like a uh, magnifying glass up in the upper right hand corner and type in your technology. So if you were doing automobiles, you type in automobiles and it will um, give you some information. And history.com, the same thing in the search box, you type in um, whatever your technology is and then the word evolution. So for example, if I was studying computers, I would do computer evolution. Or you can try straight up Google search and you can just type in how have blank changed over time. Um, please do this only from your school computers because sometimes we get random um, inappropriate sites that we wouldn't want to come up. But if you're doing it from your school computer, um, those sites should be blocked. Okay. So that is what you're doing today. Today on Monday, your only task is to come up with your topic. And if you have time, start looking up some information and see what you can find. Have a great day.